I would remember to order the wedding cake. What would you do differently if you were to do your wedding over again? Well, our wedding is not over yet. <laughs> um, we're, we're a little unique. We're having a two-part wedding. Um, we're getting married here in the clerk's office of New York, and then we're going to have a, a big celebration with family and friends uh, down in Florida after this. So uh, it's not over yet. <laughs> I would make the food come out faster. <laughs> we haven't had an official ceremony yet. We yeah. just went to the courthouse. Even now, there are people who just don't know. Like, like everyone doesn't know. <laughs> we yeah. don't feel any pressure. Yeah, it's kind of like a cool secret that we have. And we're like, oh, my wife, and they're like, whoa, wait a minute, wait, we didn't get the invite. And it's like, I know. Uh, we would last until midnight at least. <laughs> I, pa I passed out. I would not do anything differently. Our wedding differently. was incredible. We were like, okay, this is going to be out of necessity. We're gonna get married on a beautiful beach in Hawaii, and it's just gonna be the two of us and our minister. I mean, we wish that we could have had family, but I don't know that I would have done it any different now that we've done it yeah. and know how great the day was. <laughs> no. I would probably not have involved as many family members as we did, because initially they wanted to have like a really big wedding but it kind of overwhelmed us to just get into our own space and our own zone and be like, listen, we want something really small. The candy bar was kind of Oh, I guess. That's like our biggest garbage. complaint. I don't know. Like the place that we, you know, we paid all this money for an extra like candy <laughs> bar and they've had like, this expired candy. We lived in Houston, but we were getting married in Michigan um, because that's where I'm from. So it was, it's really difficult planning a wedding in a different state. You sit there and think, like, are they going to enjoy the cake? Or mm -hmm. are they going to be comfortable in the chairs that they're Remember sitting in? Remember I had that meltdown about the green chairs? Yeah. That's <laughs> no one even noticed the yeah. green chairs. We didn't do our dance. Oh, that's true. We really regret we that. We didn't have our dance. This you were really too fun. drunk to dance anyway. You're not supposed <laughs> to say that. I would have a destination wedding, smaller, um, something on the beach. I wouldn't do anything different. Would you? I would, I would bring my kids there. One lived in Atlanta and one lived in Tokyo. So they couldn't come. I would probably include more people in my wedding. I didn't really realize back then that I can kind of make up whatever I want to do for my own wedding. I kind of thought I had to pick this and this and this. My parents were not together, so my dad kind of took over the event. And I think that, you know, we just had a lot of people at the wedding that we didn't really know. I would have a bigger event, to be quite frank with you, because we had a small type of a wedding. My biggest thing would be to take lots and lots of pictures of the older people in our lives, um, because you really do miss them as the years go on. I think we'll stay sober. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sober. I know what you would change. What? Remember where I stood before and then started singing, oh, you know what they and did. you thought I changed my mind. <laughs> right? they, they didn't tell me that someone is going to sing, so she walked to the. She appeared at the end of the aisle and s stopped there. And I, all I could think was, God, you know, she ch she changed her mind. <laughs> I would remember. Show up, <laughs> not show up. Well, I think the wedding was for us exactly what we wanted. It, it, it not not only were we happy doing it, but it worked out very well. <laughs> That's right.